Hello everybody. So before we do start, let's just get the bare basics done with. This episode is an episode of the character descriptions for Christmas. Now, some of them will be disturbing, some of them won't. So yeah, just in case, viewer discretion is advised because the animalization characters do have to die first in order to become, you know, a part of the animalization. Anyways, open the door of your Antvin calendar, consume whatever is in it, unless it's plastic or a toy, don't eat toys, and enjoy the video. Why, hello there, everybody. Let's continue. So, after Martin surviving his first blood moon, Leafy was back to normal. He knew what the little green guy's name was, it was Greeny, and she was annoying. Like, very, very annoying. And so, since Martin was the second animalization character to be there, he was brought where Leafy lives, and the rest of his friends. His friends included Sketchmaster, Teardrop, and Icy. Icy being a nice cube, Sketchmaster being a dictionary, and Teardrop being a teardrop. But there was also another friend of Leafy's. She was quite shy, and she was quite nervous all the time. And despite the fact being an axolotl, she hated the water. She had aquaphobia. Leafy liked really well done things, to the point that you would literally consider it burnt. And when he accidentally forgot that Martin does not like burnt things, he snapped his fingers and it was pretty much back to normal. And neither did this other girl. But one day, when they were eating, Martin looked at what this girl was eating, a vegetarian burger. And it had barbecue sauce in it. And so on the off chance, he sort of muttered to himself, hmm, my sister used to love barbecue sauce. And she overhears him and she says, wait, you had a sister? And he goes, yeah, I used to have a sister. She was really nice. I'm just really sad on what happened to her. And so the girl asks, what happened to her? And he says, apparently, some freak decided to drown her. Luckily, she apparently died a few seconds afterwards, but I'm still very sad that she's gone. And so the girl puts down her burger and asks, was her name Daisy? Spelled D-A-Y-Z-E-E. -E. And Martin, sort of shocked, opens his eyes and said, Yeah, that's exactly how you spell my sister's name. The girl stands up, picks Martin up, and gives him the biggest hug ever. Martin, it's me, Daisy. And when Martin finds out that Daisy is the girl she's, he's been talking to. He goes, No wonder you clicked. <laughs> Giving her a massive hug and sort of crying. And Leafy is just over there with their mouth on the floor. You two are siblings? He mutters to himself. Hmm. I thought siblings hated each other. And that sort of ends Martin's story, for now. <laughs> so, why didn't I just continue this part in the last video? Because I've got something else to explain. His powers and abilities. Let's get over and done with his powers. First things first, he's extremely hot. Girls, stop. He's hot as in heat hot, not attractive hot. I mean, he could be, don't know. Anyways, so if he doesn't have his special sort of liquid on, 
which is literally known as Gilliman, which Gilliman literally, you know, can break down black holes and can literally retain a lot of heat, right? This thing literally helps him so he doesn't sort of set everything on fire. But also, another one of his abilities is being super fast. He can also teleport, and he has the strength of a thousand men. Now, he's really, really strong, and Martin would definitely be able to beat half the characters in the animalization, hence why he's always used as an example. Now... Again, this video's only been five minutes long. Why didn't I just continue with the other bit? I'm not done with the story entirely. You see, I'm going to be talking about Daisy as well. So when Daisy died, that kind of rhymed. When Daisy died, she was actually in a void. And she was going to turn into her favourite animal. But a glitch occurred. And it practically made a third door. And she went through there. And in the Antra didn't even notice until it was kind of too late. And Leafy sees this thing and he's like, what the hell is this? So he pokes some prods to see if it's actually alive. It is. She gets up, stands up and goes, what the hell am I? And she starts feeling around and she can feel that her skin is quite rough, but also soft at the same time. She looks down and she sees she's wearing her signature grey skirt with a pink jumper. And she goes, I'm an Axolotto? And pretty much that is how Daisy came to be. Now one last thing. Martin is a very, very strong character because he can turn into a dark fire form. Which is one of the rare times a character can use evil for good. Pretty much, what happens is... He can clench his fists together and think about it really hard, and suddenly, he'll turn into a dark fire. He'll get extremely hot, and... He'll sort of be somewhat distorted. He'll sound a lot angrier and louder. Instead of having the strength of a thousand men, he will have infinite stamina and infinite strength. He is one of the strongest characters in this form. Which says a lot. And one more thing. He can control his dark fighter form, unlike a lot of other characters. So, TLDR. Martin was killed by Optimum Nonix, but met with his sister in death and became one of the strongest and most loyal animalization victims. Alright, that's it. Leave a like, subscribe, and remember, I always come back, because I'm Leafy. Looks like I've got to leaf. Bye-bye, everybody, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.